Hello. In this lesson, we're going to look at something that is very common for IELTS listening. In the listening test, you often need to listen and write down a number. And of course, IELTS know all the problems that many students have with numbers in English. And one of the common problems is the difference between 15 and 50. Even for us, sometimes it can be difficult to hear the difference between 15, 50, 16, 60. So IELTS often give you those numbers in the test to test your ability to hear and understand in English. So let me give you a little test. I'm going to give you some numbers and I would like you to listen and write them down. And after that, I'll give you the answers. Now, I'm going to give you 10 numbers and they will be either a teen, 15, or a T, 50. So are you ready? You need pen and paper. Have you got it? Press pause if you need to go and get it. Right, let's start. Number one, 60. Number two, 15. Number three, 14. Number four, 70. Number five, 19. Number six, 80. Number seven, 30. Number eight, 50. Number nine, 16. And number 10, 18. That's all of them. Let's have a look at the answers. The answer for number one, is 60. Number two, 15. Number three, 14. Number four, 70. Number five, 19. Number six, 80. Number seven, 30. Number eight, 50. Number nine, 16. And number 10, 18. So how did you do? Did you get most of them right? Or did you get a lot of them wrong? Well, if you didn't do very well, continue watching and I'm going to go through the pronunciation of the numbers. Before we check the pronunciation of the numbers, let me give you a couple more links to some more IELTS lessons, just here. Now, let's have a look. As you can see, we've got the teens and the tees. Now, the difference is that this sound here is longer, 13, much longer. And this one over here is shorter, T, 30. So we have teen, T, 13, 30. So you can see there is a difference. So let's check pronunciation. 13, 30, 14, 40, 15, 50, 16, 60, 17, 70, 18, 80. And the last one, 19, 90. Let's check one more time. 50. 17, 80, 
fourteen, thirty, ninety, nineteen, fourteen. So hopefully you have learnt a little bit about the difference between numbers. Please practice. It is important. You can get that in the test and hopefully you will get that correct. Well, that's all for this lesson. I'll see you again in another IELTS lesson.